Hiya, I'm Veronica, Idea Technician here at Shabu Prints. You're about to see Chihuahua Chase, an entertaining animation about someone who in the midst of their crazy day experiences a beneficial alternate reality. Now I've had lots of crazy days and many, many challenges. But I also believe that if I were to remove just one, I wouldn't be wholly who I am today. And I like who I am today. So I've had to come to the understanding that challenges must have value. I hoped to create in Chihuahua Chase a message that life with all of its difficulties can still be good. Besides, who are we to say that alternate realities don't exist? That the one life you're living, the way you're living, it is your only option. Well, I believe in alternate realities and the fact that we can choose how we experience a reality. But in order for me to do that, I also have to believe I have options, even if only in my perception. Well, we're here to tell you that you have options. For instance, the next time I come across a challenging experience, I can choose to make it my life or an ingredient for my wonderful life. We hope to make a little room in your reality for these considerations. So for an easy three and a half minutes, let's enter the world of Shabu and enjoy Chihuahua Chase. Why am I still so unprepared for birthdays? Why, with my busy schedule, don't I plan for these things better? Right, so I have two days to find a gift. And that's when the walls of my predictable, stressful life blew open. It started with a strange sensation. The feeling was so strong, it stopped my rambling negative thoughts in midstream. I snapped my head around to confront this force, and that's when I spotted a chihuahua. It wasn't a real dog, but the likeness of one on a greeting card. I stepped closer and gently removed it from its display. Touching it was electrifying. It felt as if hundreds of soft licks kissed my hand. And I didn't even blink until I detected movement. The chihuahua on the card moved. Most people would have dropped the card and run out the door to the nearest doctor. But I just couldn't look away. The dog must have sensed my acceptance because it then winked, moved towards the edge of the card, and disappeared out of view. The card had become a portal for another dimension, a magical world that now beckoned me forward. I smiled wide and let my imagination gently carry me in. Hoo-hoo, what a rush! I felt energized, like I could run fast and jump high. My heart rate was slightly elevated. I felt youthful. The colors were intense and saturated. The temperature was perfect, and it was very bright, but I had no need to squint. I looked to my right, and there was the Chihuahua walking toward a distant purple mountain range. I noticed I ran easily without stress or losing my breath. It was then I realized how much weight I carry on a daily basis. From my job, expectations put on me by others, and self-imposed responsibility. I hadn't felt this way since I was a kid, and I was overcome with grateful nostalgia. The chihuahua stopped. It raised its paw as if it were pointing forward, where I saw a meerkat wearing a feathered headdress. Beside the meerkat was a picket sign that read, Free Cloud Readings. I never heard of such a thing. My mind began to stir, and I heard my inner voice say, I worry so much. I worry about everything. Silence floated between us. Am I really going to be okay, I asked. The cloud reader then consulted the sky, and I got my answer. Wow. Can I help you with anything? Huh? Oh, yes. I'll go ahead and take this card. Just then, I looked back toward the wall of cards, where I saw a German shepherd winking at me. I'll take that one, too. (laughs) Oh, <laughs>